First was the Employee Free Choice Act. I support it. I think if you, you look at yeah. it as voting for it, look at what's happened in the, in, in the imbalance between uh, management and labor and, and the way that uh, management has, has been redefined and all these different things, I, I think we need it. My plea is we, we need enough senators from the Democratic Party so that we can conduct the business of this country without a filibuster. Um, you know, with your help and with your, with your strong help, I was elected two years ago. I became kind of known as number 51. You know, I was a violation yeah. uh, that helped us in a number of ways. We had the committee chairs, we had to build into the majority leader, we can arguably set the agenda, but everything that we have attempted to do that has had any substance to it all has been filibustered. When I filibuster, you need 60 votes. You know, Barbara Boxer, the senator from California, says 60 is the new 50. You know, we got to uh, every single thing that, that has any argument to it all has been filibustered. Before this Congress, in the entire history of the country, the most filibusters that had ever happened in the United States Senate were 62 in two years. We had 63 filibusters in one year last year. So you can see how many of these important pieces of legislation have been stalled in the Senate. So we need to get to that number.